Alright, hey guys, uh, we're in quarantine. Day 27 in quarantine. Wing Ton's starting to look a lot more attractive now. Um, so, what we're going to start doing over the next X amount of weeks is I really want to um, encapsulate and put together the fundamentals program that we're going to build here um, for when we get back and also maybe to help out other smaller gyms that need some help uh, with their students and whatnot. So what's going to happen is we're going to be picking up major positions in Jiu Jitsu um, and I want to talk about them conceptually, not just giving techniques. So I want to talk about where our weight should be, you know, uh, strategies for distributing our weight, what our spine alignment hip positioning should be, as well as showing basic techniques, just so that beginners, you know, can understand the position and, and not just have rope talk techniques. Um, so today, the first thing we're going to look at is we're going to look at our, our top closed guard position. Okay, so. The first thing to realize from here is if I don't dispute weight on my partner, he's going to be able to move, cut angles on me and, and, and start really doing nasty things to me. So I've got to start to figure out how I can put effective weight on my partner. So the way you do this is by building a wedge. So part of my wedge and my hands. Yeah? The middle, my shoulders, and then back down to where my hips are. So where my hips are will, will determine how effective and where my weight is placed on my partner, okay? So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get our arms inside in our partner because the thing you don't wanna happen is have your hands on the mat. Again, hands are on the mat, my weight is not on my partner, my partner can start to move and do things that I don't like. The first thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna swing my hands inside and get on my toes. When I'm toes alive in guard, your hips come up, come higher, and it means that I can distribute weight further up my partner's body. Again, I don't want to be on my toes here. So if you look up at my shoulders, okay, that angle is no good. This is not stable. But if I distribute weight here, okay, this is very nice for me and very safe for me. Okay. The other thing I have is I'm looking for that inside position of your partner. Okay. And this will be a common theme throughout this whole series: is if you're ever in doubt and you don't know where to grab, you want to be inside your partner. Okay. So again, this is outside my partner. And I want to become inside. Okay, so this is our first position. So he can be grabbing my head, breaking my posture. From here I reach in and I come onto my toes. Okay. Now sometimes you might be uh, resting this one really strong. So from here, he's got my posture. I'm going to come up and over, get on my toes, open my partner up, and now create a space to slide inside. 